Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to go about resolving if the Active Directory Domain Services is currently unavailable when you're attempting to print something on your Windows device. So I imagine this could definitely be a frustrating issue and in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve it. And we are going to start by opening up the Start menu, type in Services, Best match should come back with services listed right above app. Go ahead and left click on that. Locate the print spooler service and double click on that. Set startup type to automatic. And if server status is stopped, you want to select the start option and see if that does resolve the problem. And then once you're done with that, you can go ahead and close out of here. Next thing you want to do is open up the star menu, type in regedit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match should come back a registry editor. You want to right click on that and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now before you proceed, you will want to create a backup of your registry. So if anything goes wrong, you can easily restore it back. And in order to do that, it's very simple. Just go ahead and left click on the file tab and then export. File name, usually the date, is what I would recommend making as the file name and then export range, keep it at all, and save it to an easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever need to import it back in, you would select file and then import. So pretty straightforward. And now we are ready to begin. So double click on the HK current user folder. Do the same thing now for the software subfolder. Same thing for Microsoft. Locate Windows NT right here, double click on that. And there should be a current version folder under here, double click on that. And now locate the devices folder, right click on it and select permissions. So now you wanna locate your user account on here or whatever account you're having the problem with. So it might be a different account that you're having an issue with here. And you wanna go make sure allow is checkmarked to full control for that user account. So again, pretty straightforward process, just to show you guys an example of what it would look like. You just would click inside the full control box and then select apply and OK. And then you want to do the same thing for the printer ports folder. So go to permissions, make sure your user accounts are set to allow for full control as well as read. So it's particularly full control, that's what you want to make sure is the case. And then you'd want to do it again for the Windows folder underneath here. Permissions. Again, make sure your user account is set to full control, as well as administrators as well. So administrators in your user account probably make the most amount of sense. And once you know with that, you can close out of here. What's it just restart your computer? And that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. Do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.